திருமுருகன் ஒர்க்கிங் ஆஸ் எ பிஜி மேத்தமெட்டிக்ஸ் கவர்மெண்ட் ஹயர் செகண்டரி ஸ்கூல் வழிதாவூர் விழுப்புரம் டிஸ்ட்ரிக்ட் விச் பிளாங்ஸ் டு தமிழ்நாடு டிஸ்ட்ரிக்ட் டுடே ஐ எம் கோயிங் டு கிவ் ஷார்ட் கட் மெத்தட் ஐடியா அப்ரோச் ஃபார் த ஸ்கொயர் ரூட் ஆஃப் காம்ப்ளெக்ஸ் நம்பர் இன் திஸ் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஐம் கிவிங் ஃபார்முலா ஃபார் ஸ்கொயர் ரூட் ஸ்கொயர் ரூட் ஆஃப் ஏ பிளஸ் ஐ பி ஈக்குவல் டு ப்ளஸ் ஆர் மைனஸ் ஸ்கொயர் ரூட் ஆஃப் இசர் பிளஸ் ஏ பை டூ பை பிளஸ் மாலினஸ் ஆஃப் இசர் மைனஸ் ஏ பை டூ இன் திஸ் ஃபார்முலா ஒன் மே கிவ் பிளஸ் தி ஆர் கிவன் பிளஸ் யூ டேக் இட் பிளஸ் ஏ சப்போஸ் ஒன் மே கிவ் இன் இமே பார் நெகட்டிவ் யூ டேக் இட் கேர் மைனஸ் so uh, depending upon the question you take it plus or minus for this imaginary part uh, uh, it is useful for jee iit main and advanced exam this short uh, method is important only for the entrance not for the classroom practice first i take uh, uh, one question square root of minus 8 minus 6 i one may ask uh, find out the square root of minus 8 minus uh, uh, 6 i how can we use we use the formula square root of a plus b uh, here a a is equal to minus a here b is equal to minus 6 a is equal to minus a b is equal to minus 6 first we find out the modulus of z modulus of z is equal to you know that modulus of z is equal to a square plus b square that is a uh, real square real part square plus imaginary part square here a square is equal to a square 64 b square A six minus six square thirty six. You can add these two. We get a uh, hundred. So the modulus of z is equal to ten. Directly you can find out in our mind to apply z is equal to ten. I am using formula here plus or minus square root of. We know that we are having uh, is modulus of z is equal to ten. We apply here so ten. Uh, here a we need. a is minus a from the question you take it minus 8 is as a a so we here put a for minus 8 by 2 the given question in imaginary part they are given minus symbol so that here we apply minus minus i then modulus of z we need already we found that we uh, taking modulus of z equal to 10 here also here minus a we are having also a value minus a minus of minus here we need a value a is minus a already we have formula minus z. so we take it plus 8 by 2 simply we uh, simplify by simplification uh, 8 10 minus 8 you know that 2 2 by 2 here also 2 plus minus here minus 10 plus 8 is equal to 18 18 by 2 Simplify, minus five. What two by two is equal to one? So square root of one plus minus eighteen uh, by two is equal to nine. Then finding the square root of uh, one is equal to one. Then minus i square root of nine is equal to three. So the square root of value for uh, minus eight minus six i is equal to plus or minus one minus three i. This is the shortcut method. When we use when we are writing in the entrance exam or complete exam, we should use this method. Clear, we can easily clear the uh, the objective type questions. Another method, uh, same question I can take it, but uh, I can use another method for finding minus eight minus six i square root. Another method. This method for finding the square root, we need uh, square numbers. One square is equal to one. Three and knowledge. Two squares equal to four. Three squares equal to nine. Four squares equal to sixteen. Five squares equal to twenty-five. These are the things first we need before finding the square root. After that, we write minus eight minus six i. Here we need minus eight. Uh, we take uh, nine and one. One minus nine is equal to minus eight. We are taking only nine and one because. Uh, One minus nine only we are getting minus eight. So that I take it uh, square number uh, one minus nine minus six i. After that we write one one square. For uh, minus nine we write three i whole square. We may write minus six i in the form of two a b two into a here one. Then b is three i. This is the form. I get minus. So we say a plus b whole a minus b 
whole square. So a minus a square b square two a b. So a minus uh, b whole square. We need a square root minus eight minus six a is equal to taking square root. We are putting plus or minus one minus three a square cancelled. In this way. We get this is another method. In this way, we get uh, square root of minus eight minus six i is equal to plus or minus one minus three i. By using this method, we can find out another uh, another question. Another question square root. Another question we take five plus uh, two a i. One may ask to find the square root of uh, five plus two a i. We use uh, uh, this formula method, shortcut formula method, or otherwise the uh, square uh, square number method. Five. We write uh, five. Five. We want to find. So uh, nine minus four is equal to five. So five plus two a i is equal to. We need five. We taking nine and uh, nine and four. Nine minus four. We nine minus four. We get five. Here uh, two a i. We make it a form for uh, a plus b whole square. Nine. We write to three square minus four for two i square. We all know that here a square, here b square. Another part we want two a b, two into three into two i. This is a form of a plus b whole square, a square, b square, two a b. Writing this a plus b whole square, three plus two uh, i whole square. So we need uh, to find out the square root. Taking square root on both sides. Five uh, plus two i whole square is equal to plus or minus three plus two i. Uh, taking square root to cancel, we get plus or minus three plus two uh, i. Uh, dear students, use this method in the exam uh, of uh, IIT J main and cons. You can uh, easily uh, tick the tick means that uh, you select the answer easy method. Uh, thank you very much. Bye. Thank you.